Hello. Um, so I don't know how montagey this is gonna get, but uh, I'm going to be cutting out the dungeon aspect or portion of this. Um, I'm hoping that this will be the end, but um, if it's not, then uh, we will just be, you'll just be seeing the boss portion of this because you've seen me do the dungeon and it's the same every time and I don't want to give myself an opportunity to complain about it. So um, I'm going to be trying something new. I am going in completely naked. Completely naked. And that's going to give me 125% uh, of my movement. So hopefully that buys me enough movement to, um, you know, get to where I need to go. I'll definitely put armor back on um, once I, you know, have done the first portion of this. Once I have uh, basically made the boss mortal. Um, speaking of which, I'm already just going to... Hold on. But you know what I should do here is... Um, top left, top right, bottom right, bottom left... It, uh, I, I recognize what uh, what I did wrong last time, um, which is that I probably should not have tried to make it through that flame gate in time, or, uh, you know, bef before it closed, because it, it had already been too late. Um, so I had a better method that worked before, which was uh, basically to... Um, stand at the beginning or the tunnel uh and check the flame gate and try and see if i can make it um but that requires me to stop and the boss is generally like right behind me i don't know if you can take two like get deathly gaze twice when you're low um so i i might need to like heal when i get deathly gaze but hopefully it won't come to that um boss sucks not a huge fan that's that's the only thing i'm gonna say about that and i'm gonna hope that i make it through this okay we did not get death lead there which is good and i do have more movement so i can actually make it to this flame before uh before the boss makes it here so that's good so we're gonna start with tarthus Success! Hey, we got lucky. Um, so that's bottom right. Uh, now the problem is, is that I don't think I'll be able to make it back through. Yeah, I would have. That would have been bad for me. I am gonna get death lead. I'm not gonna worry too much about my health just yet. Well, we have a moment here. Uh, what I could do is make a wolf just to just to buy me some time. And then I'm going to go and heal. Um, and while I'm waiting here for the gate, I'm also going to take a Staria draft because I'm going to want another wolf at some point. Um, really hoping that this isn't already a dead end. Okay, that, that was kind of brutal. I won't lie. So I'm going to take take the uh, w on that i could have walked through that but i'd prefer to do it this way um i could try carrion on this one. Oh god i okay let's let's do it this way and i'm gonna wait okay there's the boss right behind me and i'm gonna want to go right i think so let's try carrion Oh no. So, um, top left is not true this time. So I'm just going to make a note of that. So let's go to top right if I can. I think I should be able to make this. Yep. I think the extra um, movement speed is helping. I'm gonna... Oh, wow, that Staria route didn't give me enough energy, so that's kind of sucky. Um, let's just try... 
Might need to go back the way I came, but I don't know. Let's try Karian again. I, I don't know if it's case sensitive and I'm, I'm too... You know, I don't want to chance it. Okay, so... Um, top right is not good. We don't need to try bottom right. We could try the center. Now, I'm worried about not making this. Uh, I need to take a... I'm going to take another route. And then make a wolf. Uh, and then we're going to take a large healing potion. And then while I'm waiting, I'm going to take a um, Staria Draft. That's my wolf dead. We'll try Karian for the center. Not sure where I'm going to want to go next. Um, I guess we'll want to go either down or left. Um, let me see. What do I want to do here? Well, I guess I want to take a, the moment I have right now. And i um, just going to take another Staria Draft. Because I'm going to need, you know, if... if I'm going to need my wolf. Um, might even, like, spawn it now. While we've got the extra, like, turn. And then we'll try Carrion. Success. Okay. Um, so I'm going to make a note here that it was the center. So center's done. And so is Karian. So next up is Hezra. Um, I think that going left would be the thing to do. Yeah. Because it was just closed. Or, sorry, opened. Um, I'm going to need to put some amber in my lamp. And you just got to be careful which direction you go. Because you can get hemmed in. And if if you haven't heard a, a like a doom like a opening lately then you might not want to chance going into one of these tunnels. Um, so I'm just going to go ahead and yell Hezra. Hopefully we get lucky here. Oh no. Okay, so um, bottom left is not it. That's, that's the play. Um, I don't think I've, I don't think top left has been used. So far it's been bottom right and center. So we'll try Hezra on the top left. Don't know what happened to our wolf. Hopefully they didn't die. But I guess while I'm here, I'll take another couple of Staria drafts. Actually, um, since I do have the extra movement, what I might do is let's let's brew up another. I could I should have done this before, but I have time, so I'll brew up um, a couple of extra Staria drafts. Staria draft. If you've got the roots, it's it's better to have Staria drafts. Um, don't worry, I'm I'm keeping an eye down here. As soon as they walk, you know, if I see them at all then I'll, I'll yell out my next one, which is Hezra. Um, I don't even know if that uses up time, but like we've got time to spare. And I guess that's all of the, all, all of the Staria drafts I can spare to make. So with that in mind, let's do... Uh, let's, what's our gate? Okay, so that's not looking good, to be honest. So what I might do... Okay, there was a Doom. I think that down is going to be our, our, our next move. So I'm going to go ahead and do Hezra. Hezra. Oh no. Okay, so... Top left is also an X. Um, that's only going to leave top right for Hezra. But we can only move down right now. 
so I'm going to move down here and we're going to try the next one, which is Balatoth. There was just a doom. We could potentially make that, but I don't know how I feel about that. Balatoth. Oh no. Okay, so bottom left is an X on that. I actually think that I would prefer to go back up. Mm, no, we could just as easily get hemmed in up. Yeah, that's what I was afraid of. Let's um make a construct. Oh, I I didn't mean to do that actually. Shoot. Okay, we're going to take a um Staria draft. Jesus. Oh my god. <sighs> okay, hold on. We're not completely out of the woods here. Or, sorry, not... We're definitely not out of the woods. We're not completely hosed just yet. Let's do a leap of faith. Zoot back. Um... What's our gateway like right now? Okay, so let's, let's move back up. We're blind right now. So let's take a sight salve. I might honestly want to use that teleportation more often i'm sure someone uh, is grateful that i rediscovered that okay so up is the move would honestly like to go right so maybe we can wait yeah let's wait yes i know low health um let's drink a potion uh and drink another potion um, so let's see, top left still hasn't been used. Top left might be Balatoth. We haven't done a noon yet either. Uh, I feel like going up is the play right now. What's, uh, oh god, I don't like it when they're both open like that. Okay, that's better, actually. Um, let's drink another Staria Draft. That'll give us enough for a wolf if we need one. Um, I, honestly, I wonder if maybe using that teleportation is, isn't, like, what we're intended to do. So, let's, like, put this on one. And, um, Balatoth, let's try Balatoth on this one. Success. We managed to dodge as well. Okay, let's zoot over. That blinds us, by the way. Um, I'll take a, si a salve as soon as I can. So let me make a note of that. So top left was correct. So, Hezra, um, let me just, so we've done bottom right, center, and top left. So, top right is still available, and bottom left is still available. Right? Bottom right, center, and top left. So, we need to go to top right. What's our gateway like right now? Uh, it's not great, to be honest. We'll, we'll try. Um, I think going up would be the play. Oh, never mind. Kind of want to go very roundabout at this point. Just kite them around a bit. Wait, oh, they're right there. Shoot. Okay, we're just, we're going to take the long way around. How are they making it so quickly? This is, oh god, I, I really hate this boss. 
I I can't tell you. Um don't yet really want to waste our any of our uh, constructs. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to drink a starry up draft and then throw down a wolf. And hopefully the wolf will buy us a bit of time. Oh, I guess we didn't need to, but that's okay. They'll, they'll, they'll be useful. Um, while I have a free moment here, I'm going to drink another starry draft. That'll let me teleport. Okay. So top left, um, Still haven't done Hezra and haven't done Anun. So let's try Hezra. Success. Oh god. Okay, I'm gonna hope that this goes away. Yes. So the only one left is bottom left. So we're going to go to bottom left. And this is going to be a noon. But before we do this, um, we I think we officially can start putting on some armor. Um, so we're going to do this with God's Needle and um, Shield of Warding. Uh, I'm not going to try and tank anything. I need as much resistance as I can get, and that's going to offer us the most resistance. Don't know what this actually does for us. So, plate mail armor, chain gloves, plate mail greaves, um, and nose guard helmet, and uh, what kind of resistance can we get? Dodge like 30 would be really nice. This is what I usually use is Herodias helmet because it gives us physical, but uh, this guy's not physical basically at all. So that's a bummer. Um, Clown's pendant would be nice, I guess, for some extra madness defense. I don't know. Um, is there, we can equip the great arc. Don't know if that'll actually help. Would have been nice if we could have used our Thrana. But I really do need those resist resistances if I can get them. Alright, um... So the play here is, uh, as soon as I... Well, let's also fill our... Let's fill our Amber Bane oil. Pour into Ward. What's our gateway like right now? It's not great. Actually, I think that going right would probably be better. Uh, I just need an escape route. Um, but what I want to do actually while I have the time right now is I'm going to drink a Staria Draft and make a wolf and then I'm going to drink a Staria Draft and another Staria Draft. Actually, let's, yeah, let's do another Staria Draft and then, um, make a Paragon. And then we're going to drink another two Stereo Drafts, which is going to basically finish us off. And we're going to make Moonlight. The boss is almost upon us, so I am... I don't really have much more time to spare. So then we're just going to type in a noon. Success. What's our gateway like? It's kind of not great. If I had a teleport right now, that would be ideal, but I don't have any more Staria. Um, we are going to get deathed. There's no way around that. So I need to... What I want to do, actually, is throw down um, some constructs just to put the some stuff b between us. I should have made all of our constructs if we could. I might actually be able to get away with this. And then, um, well, I can't shoot because the construct's in the way. I'm just going to let them do as much as, I possi as they possibly can. Uh, 
Uh, I guess actually, while I have time right now, let's um con make some more constructs. Uh, I guess I kind of don't want to be in this zone. And, um, okay, that's that's as many constructs as we can afford to make. Does, does my arrows go through these fires? They actually do. Now, um, I, I'm blind right now, so I'm going to make a, um, throw down a construct. I, I can see where they are, or at least I can hear where they are. Oh, God. Okay, we're on fire. Let's um, put ourselves out. And also, let's get rid of our blindness right now. Sight self. Apply. Wow, he has, like, taken, like, no damage. We are... I don't even know what killed me there. I guess I was on fire. I... I don't know. I kind of feel like this is unfair. I think I did as much as I possibly could there, and I still... You know, ate it. Almost, like, instantly in a way that I could not have really predicted. I don't know what happened there. I assume it's, like, I got death lead and set on fire at the same time. I have to wonder if I'm not missing something. Like, is there a, some kind of tool or device or, uh, you know, amulet or something that I'm supposed to have? Um, but, like, this seems really un unreasonable to me. But, um, I don't know. I, I think I'm going to give it one more try. Like, genuinely just one more try. And then, uh, and then I might, I don't know, uh, look, look into stuff. See if I can't do some research. Um, but this, this is not very fun for me. So, uh, yeah, I'll give it one more go. I'll see you when I get to the boss. Hello. All right. Well... This, uh, this may very well be my last attempt. I really don't know. Um, I did a little bit of grinding. I, uh, went and bought up a bunch of potions. Not that it really matters. The, the potion I really need is the, uh, panacea, and I, I wasted those, and getting them back is pretty difficult. So that's kind of a bummer. Um, the good news, I mean, I guess, you know, what I've learned is the uh, leap of faith really helps for... Um, the first part, um, getting away from the boss when they teleport in front of you is, uh, really, really good. Um, I've got a better sheet, basically, a uh, set of notes, so I should be able to take, keep better track of which, um, which God's names I've tried or attempted, and also when I've succeeded. Um, I did buy a uh alabast or arabast what is it called now uh, weapons may ranged uh arbalist sorry um i did buy one of those and so i can have a you know a better ranged weapon um yeah i mean the only thing that would be really good is if i had like basically a ton of panaceas that would be able to cure all of my ailments right away um but uh you know can't have everything so we're going to start with this over here. And actually, I think uh, it'll be a good idea to basically double back. So we're just going to start with Tarthus. Well, we actually got it. That's kind of nice. Um, I don't know if I should... I think we can walk away from this. I don't think I need to use a... Uh... Yeah, I don't need to use a teleport yet. Let me make a note. So Tarthus was on the bottom right. Um, 
So the next one up is going to be Karian. What's our... Well, we don't... I haven't... I haven't seen what's above us. So we might need to um, spawn a wolf just to, to buy us some time. But... Um, and why don't we go ahead and do that now? And then I'll go ahead and take a uh, draft. I did uh, grind up a, a little bit of Staria roots so I have more roots. Or uh, more potions. I made as many Staria drafts as I could. So 15 should be enough. We have enough for a teleport, so... Um, wouldn't mind actually opening this door first. Uh, I, I bungled it. I bungled it. Alright, well, let's uh, see if we can't get to a different room. At least our wolf didn't, like, get squandered. Hopefully we can make it to this in time. Okay, so let's try... Let's try Kari in here. It doesn't matter where we try it because they're they're shuffled every time as far as I know. Oh no. Okay, so I tried top left. That was not it. Uh we're gonna wanna double back. Basically, you should head to the the gateway that like already has fire. And that, uh, I, like, I actually will probably want to double back again, you know? That's kind of where I'm at, Karian. Oh, no. Okay, so, um, top right. So that means it's either center or bottom left. Oh, no. Okay, this is, uh, not really what we want. We could try and just wait. Ugh, I, I hate this position. I mean, the, the, the good news, I guess I can teleport past them. So we'll just... Yeah, okay. We're good. I should have gone south. That was a little bit silly. But that's fine. We have plenty of time now. We'll position ourselves. Karyun... Oh no, oh god. I am- I refuse to be annoyed about this. Um, I think actually heading straight east would be a good play. Yep. So, the only one I haven't tried is actually bottom left. So we're going top right right now, so we may as well try the next one, which is Hezra. Uh, let's just double check. Yeah, we're going to be going left. Hezra. Success. Okay, so top right is three. Um... And we'll continue. Let's go to center, because uh, that's probably going to be Karian. And then we only have top left and bottom left, which is going to be Belatoth and Anun. So what's our setup right now? We're probably going to go... Well, we can't really know until we get there, I suppose. Uh, we're probably going to want to go left. So let's just do our Karian. Wait, did I already try center? I did try center. So actually, this could be Balatoth. Oh no. So we tried center. That means center is a noon and Karyon is bottom left. Uh, did I mess this up somehow? I did. Oh well. We'll get through this. This is uh, not the worst part about this, to be honest. Okay, so uh, we've tried top left. We've tried uh, for Karyan. So let's try Balatoth here. 
Have I... I feel like I did Balatoth and I didn't make a note of it. Oh, no. Okay, so Balatoth was in the top left. So that's four. Uh, we're going to want to head right. I'll try a noon for center. Uh, we'll probably want to go down. So, yell a noon. Success. So, a noon was... Uh, center was a noon. So that means Karyan is bottom left for sure. Now the problem is is they're actually very close so we're gonna we're gonna do this um but i'm actually gonna run away uh so the only one yeah karyan um not actually sure which direction i want to go in neither of these are looking very good to me so i probably want to head north i uh, i think what i'll do actually is i'm gonna go this way and then yeah uh we, I was going to say, if we didn't get lucky like that, then I was going to, um, you know what, I do not want to head into that room. Um, if we didn't get lucky, I was just going to teleport past him. So we're stunned right now. Uh, let's take, I think it's an Acerta. A, a Citra. Um, stunned, yep. Yeah. Since I don't have panaceas, I'm going to be taking a bunch of potions. Just like an ungodly number of potions. I couldn't set up, unfortunately, all of my, like, uh, critters and creatures, you know. So, we got to do this now. Oh, we're maddened. I might have to... Well, I'm going to spawn the wolf. Uh, I also, I, I want to put our armor back on. Not that it helps at all. It really doesn't help. So maybe instead of putting armor on that, like, protects us, because nothing protects us, um, I might want to just put on stuff that gives us some resistance. Um, and I think the only thing I really have that gives us resistance is um, possibly madness. I don't know what this does. Heart-shaped amulet. I mean, I could put this on. I don't know if that does anything. This gives us stun defense. Okay, that's like the only thing that gives us any defense. Magical defense multiplier. I mean, there is that. Madness defense. I'll put on the shield of warding, but honestly, I want to have um, as much running speed as possible. Um, and let's put on our, let's, let's try our great arbalist. We have, those use bolts, by the way, so that's going to be nice. The problem is, is the, I feel like the, um, the tether's movement speed, like, almost triples. Let's, um, let's drink a, let's, like, at least ensure that we don't get uh, flamed. So I'm gonna, like, I really, I really, I can't tell you how much I resent that the fact that he just is allowed to have the most, the most unfun, most broken spell in the game and, like, use it whenever, like, at will. It's just, I, you know, it, it really does a lot to ruin this for me. Um... I'm gonna kind of eek around him. Actually, my, my wolf is gonna die any second now, so I'm actually gonna teleport over here. That unfortunately blinds us. <sighs> Sight self. We're just gonna take this as slow as I possibly can, and uh, that's not very slow because he's already almost on us. So I'm gonna go ahead and throw down a minor construct. Uh, 
and we'll throw down another minor construct and i'm gonna drink um a potion uh a stereo draft and then another stereo draft uh, or madness i just need to make sure i'm oh my god i i hate this i i have to say it i'm sorry i hate this this is not fun it's not fun <laughs> <clears throat> Now I have to drink two potions to get rid of madness and stun. Fortunately, he's in the wall right now. Um, so, you know, it's that's buying us a little bit of forgiveness. Let's go ahead and just get rid of uh, a flame for a moment. Our construct is almost dead. We're not stunned anymore, which is good. Um, let's throw it our wolf because, yeah, all right, that's problem uh how's our flame gate okay a flame gate is actually okay we're almost poisoned let's drink an antidote um we're almost blind so let's do a sight salve oh is that wait what how come did i do a silent salve by accident um throw down another construct basically whenever i have a moment i'm gonna throw down a construct yep we're blind even though i drank the potion i thought it would like reduce the effects of the blindness but no and you, you have to use it after you're blind uh if you can't tell my my patience for this is like gone So we're just gonna get to the other side of this and then as they um approach us first of all let's just go ahead and splash yourselves oh i applied instead of throwing i, I found out you got you actually want to like throw it down uh, and more madness i i basically don't have a moment ever like i don't ever have a moment to do anything other than just like reduce the effects of stuff and it that really bites <laughs> Okay, so I think our construct is dead. I would like to... Oh, we're torpid. Let's drink a black water uh, draft. I think that is good. Yeah. I'd like to do some damage, like any damage, but that was kind of it because now I have to drink a draft and then throw out a wolf in a second. Wolf time. Um... Oh, we're almost poisoned. I just, the only thing I, I just cannot abide is me being on fire. I can abide by almost anything else. I, I'm almost out of bitter leaf brew. Uh, what just happened? Oh, we're blind. Yeah, we are blind. Okay, this is our last bitter leaf brew. Where are you going, Wolf? I honestly wonder if it wouldn't be better to just like hang out in one of these rooms and like kite them around. You get set on fire almost immediately i was just i was just thinking you know it would be kind of nice if we, if we could give ourselves a wet status and then resist that just a little bit um we have taken some damage i'm not sure from what let's take a one of these um we'll take a couple of these staria drafts and I, okay, like I can't even take two potions in a row because I am constantly having to battle uh, status effects. Um, we'll take in a Citra. Uh, we're just gonna have to contend with. Am I stunned again immediately? It says that I'm stunned. Yeah, we, we're like immediately stunned every round. 
Uh, that might be GG, and and that will this will be my last attempt. Um, after this, I'm gonna like I I don't know. I might just like leave it for uh like, you know, I'm not gonna take the bad ending because that's there's permanency in that. But I am gonna wait and see if that maybe this boss gets uh nerfed somewhat. I, I'm I'm for real about that, by the way. Like, I can't I can't imagine this is fun for anyone. Give me a second. All right. Uh, don't know when I took as much damage. Um, this is it. This is the end, by the way. I, I can't. I can't get rid of stun, and I can't get rid of um, madness, and I don't have any panaceas, and he gets to do that whenever he wants. Um, I'll take a staria draft and throw down a wolf. And basically, if I don't move down, I'm dead. I, I'm i attacking him, which is novel. If I can shoot him, it would be nice. Nope, torpored or uh, death. So now basically, if he hits me once, I am dead. Uh, I guess if I had some energy, I could teleport but that's not gonna happen and if i take a healing potion that i will just die um so i don't know between taking a health potion or taking a staria draft i couldn't tell you which is the right answer well i mean i i managed to get away with that so i will leap of faith away and we'll take a large healing potion that was the sound of my wolf dying, so while I have even a split second, I'm going to throw down another minor construct. In fact, I think throwing down two wouldn't be a bad idea. Uh, I am on fire right now, so let's go ahead and... Uh, splash. I didn't mean to do that, I meant to throw it down. I meant to throw it down, it's fine. Um, take a, a potion healing. Take a sight salve. We are, uh, yeah. I mean, this is this is really we're torpor we're we're death. Um, I have to hope that maybe he can't move and attack me at the same time. But who could say? Um, we're still death lead. I mean, I've t I've gotten him down quite a bit, it must be said. Uh, if I could take a Staria draft and teleport, that would be good. Blind. So we'll take a sight salve. I think that was my construct dying. Do I have any more of those? Yeah, I have one more. Um... Honestly, the only thing I have to make sure I don't, you know, like I, not being torpid would be nice because that like what triples our turn time or something ridiculous. Um, so, I'll, you know, try and not be torpored. Uh, I don't want to be on fire. That's a huge no, no. We'll uh, summon as much as we can. And basically, whenever I have a moment, I'm taking, I'm drinking Staria drafts because that's the only thing keeping us alive right now. There's like a, a, a maybe chance I could actually pull this off. Oh, if I get set on fire here, I'm just going to drink a large potion and splash water throw water down holy shit i did it holy shit oh god oh i hated every second of that oh, oh a good lord oh my god Everything I said was true. That boss needs nerfing. I'm I don't care that I did it. I don't care that it's possible. That was not fun.
That was ridiculous. I will, I will die on that hill. So what now? I think we can leave. As you emerge from the gloom, you notice the amber is, has gone, and something strange and bright hangs upon the horizon. Could this be the sun of ancient times? You wonder what else might have changed in the world. You feel a shift in your pack as ancient keys turn to dust in the outside air. Amber is gone. Uh, and so are my spells. Uh, G does nothing. The god screen is not available at this time. Can I... Okay, at least I can still use this. This is Sibirun tech, so I guess technology still, you know, has a function in the world. I'm not really sure. I, I still feel like there must be something in here. Oh my god. We can still have the rotting effect. What are... I feel like there was more here that is... gone. The world is certainly different. Um... Apothecaries. I want to talk to... <clears throat> I want to talk to basically any of the, uh head religious you know like the bishops basically oh this is possibly the worst one to have to access it seems like i have to walk around the entire town just to get to them yeah pretty much what, what okay Let's talk. Do, we have, do you have anything to say? I don't recognize the thing, this thing in the sky. Sun. Oh, I can't actually say anything to him. Is this a new moon? Okay. Um, I guess it kind of is, bud. You're gonna have to relearn how everything works, aren't you? Let's go to Wintershoal. Uh, that's not Wintershoal, is it? Yeah, no, it's this one. I would have thought that maybe um, the graphics would change slightly. Maybe they have, and I, I'm not really noticing. But I would have thought that uh, the presence of actual light would mean that we have like we can actually see now right um let's unequip our shield of warning i can't i honestly cannot believe i i pulled that off um let's put some armor on as well Wow, you really killed my construct, huh? That guy, that construct had a hand in destroying all the gods in the world. Or at least disconnecting them from this, this realm. Um, well, we're, I'm, I'm going to go ahead and like, this is the last episode. I, 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 there might be like cleanup. Um, there might be more in the future. But, um... Oh, I didn't actually go to Winter Shoal. There might be cleanup. There might be more. Um, who can say? Uh, you might see a return, uh, like maybe a um, epilogue episode for me. But um, I want to 
I want to talk to all of the uh, priests. The amber. I hear the amber is gone. It is. It's gone. I kind of wouldn't mind going to Moon Upon Thos and talking to the current Archon. I feel like that would be interesting because uh, the if you didn't know, the Archon at Moon Upon Thos is how you get the bad ending. And um, I'm kind of interested in how that changes. Uh, we want to go to uh, Magma. Yeah, Burning Rock. I definitely think the Ar uh, the uh, Arbalist had... Like, it was a good idea to switch to that, maybe. I, I don't know. It seemed to do pretty good damage. Um, I was content with it anyway. Uh, we'll definitely... We'll talk to Roche, since they're the ones that kind of put me on this quest. We'll go to Moon Upon Thos and talk to the uh, Archon. And, um... Yeah, those are, like, the major things. I don't know if there's much else to do. We might go back to our farm and talk to our brother, I think they are. I don't recognize this thing in this guy. You guys all kind of say the same thing, don't you? I did notice a few people say that uh, the ending is kind of anticlimactic. Like, you do it, and then, and then what? There's not really much... There's not even a credits rule, as far as I know. But I'm not sure if that's true. This is your credits roll cutscene. There you go. That's it. <laughs> um, yeah, so let's go to the Archon. I guess we could talk to everyone here. What's going on? My gifts. What happened to my gifts? They're gone. I feel so alone now. Who will watch over us? Did the world end? I don't understand. I feel so alone now. Who will watch over us? That's it, huh? You guys. Okay. So this is the Archon, I believe. Where is my god? I cannot hear their voice. I don't know if that is actually the Archon. I thought it was. Maybe I was wrong about that. What did the villagers say? What is this burning ball in the sky? Okay. Uh, yeah, I don't know if there's really much to do here in um, Moon Upon Thos. Hey, you know what I should do? Let me just check. I, I could have finished uh, a couple things while I was traveling around the world, but um, I, I just missed it. Whatever. We missed it. I was just wondering if I could have got that the, the heart in the wall. And uh, no, I don't think that the extra 50 health from getting the extra health or a heart in that wall would have really made a difference at all since the boss just has a spell that destroys your health completely oh we could go this way what, what, what yeah what's going on over here there must be something cool over here archon the archon smiles through tears the gods they are gone my mind is my own few will understand your achievement and fewer will think it is a good thing. Not for some time, at least. We, sh we too shall know the truth. Please take the throne. Caldera will need a new leader. Come, it is yours. Everyone hail the new Archon. Hail. Uh. Hail. Yay! <laughs> you sit upon the throne. You, Big Simple, Caldera's new Archon? Ruler of a land with a sun and moon. And no gods. Archon somehow me seems an appropriate title. But that is a problem for tomorrow. For now, it will have to do. Did I do it, or did I accidentally do something else? Ending to sunlight. The fireworks fade, and at 
dawn, a great light rises in the sky, a sun like those gazed upon by the Sibirun in centuries past. For now, the people are fearful, but with time, this will pass. Caldera is now godless, dreamless, and free to forge its own destiny, to choose whether the land becomes paradise or purgatory. A new day has dawned, a day without devotion, gifts or sin, and night will bring dreams of a different kind. We've done it. It has been done. I have achieved. And this was a lot longer of a series than I uh, intended. And I definitely uh, got pretty frustrated near the end of it. And I hope that that was still entertaining for you in some strange way. But um, yeah. Uh, the game has been, uh, let me see here delete progress i'm not doing that but like what happens if i continue i just end up back here again i could go one last thing i could do is uh, i could talk to roche i feel like uh, i don't even as archon i don't have access to these freaking doors huh hey bud can you give me the key for those doors wow i am i'm i'm the archon now and i don't have access to these doors that's that's some nonsense Hold on a second. I, I refuse. I refuse. Give me a second. Lockpick. No, I'm not paying you squat. I'm the Archon. I can do what I want. What is down here? Clank. There's some Sibirun artifacts down here. There's like nothing down here. There's a secret wall though. Yeah. Oh. What is what is this? Oh, we had to end the series with fire, didn't we? Yes, we did. Yes, we did. There's another secret, couple secret walls. Yeah, there's a couple secret walls here. Um, enough scrap of ancient metal to repair a minor construct. We have some more books. Day eight. The level of security here is ludicrous. It takes a full hour to leave safely. All for one prisoner. How much risk can they pose? Locked up in here like this. They are pacing again. Pacing and muttering. They repeatedly walk the same square. West, south, east, north. Four steps. Anti-clockwise. But I cannot hear their words. Um... So I actually don't know what this is. I don't remember what this is supposed to be. Uh, we're going to go ahead and eat some food because my, my lad is hungry. Um, but I mean, what an appropriate way to, to end the series, if not on fire. I, I do always be on fire, though, you know? I'm assuming oh my god i'm assuming is there seriously no secret door there okay that um what is what is this place this place sucks that um this is something we we could have done a lot earlier a long time earlier Almost got death gaze. We're almost getting death gaze at, at this weird place. I finally heard them clearly. The words are in Sibirun. Now I know why they need neither food nor drink. It is a it is magic, but not from the gods. I can see why the Archon doesn't want anyone to know of this. Magic works. I went to the forest. I moved as the prisoner did. I went to the forest and I moved as the prisoner did and shouted the Sibirun for wind. Fair. The wind it changed. Interesting. Ow. Ow. Got the large copper key. I have a theory of what could, who could be down here, but I don't like the theory. I don't think it makes any sense. This sucks. Is there a secret? No. Okay. Where is it? Where is the door I'm supposed to open? Okay, bottom right corner. Oh, 
what am I supposed to do here? There's no actual doors. Unlocked. We have more secrets. The prisoner moves in a different manner with a handful of dust and the words have changed. I must listen intently if I wish to learn more, but I must be careful. I know the words. I spoke them and moved as they did with a handful of dust. My vision swam and I saw. I saw the world from inside the cell for a moment. What does this mean? I don't know what it means, bud. Strange copper key. I mean, we're doing something here. I don't, I don't know what we're doing. This is like my first action as the Archon is like breaking into a potential prison and releasing someone. What do you mean find the correct pressure plate? There's no more doors. To, oh, I guess there is one bottom right corner. Oh, no, there's nothing in here. Unless there's a, another secret door here. Well, I have... I think I have, like, every key and I've opened pretty much every secret door I can find. What... what is the deal with this place? I'm on fire. Of course I am. Unless there's a... I mean, there's obviously stuff behind that wall. But how do I... How I access it, I'm not exactly sure. Unless I can... Am I supposed to do something with this torch? I'm supposed to yell. Um... Right. The... I, I, it's been telling me what I'm supposed to do, and I didn't know. Um... It's, it's gonna be, like, lost in a bunch of stuff. I wish I could sort this by like uh you know how how recently I got it cost is one minor construct missed huh uh it's gonna be like lost in this mess Uh, I think I was, I'm supposed to like pace in the way that the prisoner does and then like uh, say the magic word and I wasn't paying close enough attention maybe uh, there's secret doors that just go to traps and that's it Okay, I mean, I'm not done yet. Something is wrong with me. I can feel the prisoner's eyes behind my own, even when I close them, and their voice. So, oh, angels, help me. What have I... The note stops abruptly. This is a secret. Oh my god. A room full of fire bots. That's... This is very fitting. What a fitting way to end. Okay. Let's not die in the last moment here. Is there anything? Yeah, there's still stuff over here. Okay, there's a pressure plate. We found it. I, I mean, I've got my pure curiosity is peaked here. I really don't know what to expect here. Looks like the prisoner is gone. This is probably the person who was leaving all those notes who got swapped by accident. Farewell, reader. This witless fool's flesh shall suffice for now. Our ways are not for mortal meat like you. We were here before and shall be again. Okay, well... All in all, that didn't really tell me much. I, I, I kind of thought that maybe Bale was still alive. And, um, 
this they were keeping him there but i don't know uh i know this is running long it is the last episode but i one last thing i want to do before i end the series is i do want to go and talk to roche because surely he's got something to say although i've heard that no not really um so we go to Pharaoh Lin. Burning Rock. And then we go to... I think it's this one. Shifting Blur, yep. Yeah, I just realized, there's, yeah, there's going to be like no uh, Amber here, which is kind of cool. Hmm. Oh, yeah? The foul creatures we call gods caused the cataclysm. They covered the sun, they sent the amber. They gave us creatures to, to fear, and we gave them worship. Okay, so Roche really doesn't have anything to say, which I kind of already knew, but I wanted to confirm for myself. Uh, why am I at Moon Upon Thoughts? That's weird. I, w I was at Roche's doorstep okay well um that's that's it that's the end uh i really kind of got away with it by the skin of my teeth apparently the boss had been buffed like i watched someone else do it and they didn't have to do all that running around and uh putting out those you know beacons so you know good for me i guess for beating the boss at, in its harder state but like oh god oh that borderline ruined you know what was otherwise a, a pretty chill experience um oh drop my drop something um if you have enjoyed the series definitely hit the like button and consider subscribing for more content like this and let me know in the comments is there anything else i should check out are there any other like nooks and crannies that i missed are there like some secrets that i missed uh, uh, like is there any kind of like hidden meaning to things who was locked up under under the caldera you know stuff like that um give me hit me up with some recommendations for what you'd like to see next i uh, i'm seeing stuff for avernum I, I wouldn't mind trying avernum so i might um i actually it's one of the few games i don't uh own so i gotta i gotta maybe <clears throat> pick that up at the next steam sale or gog um but either way Thank you very much for joining me. It's uh, it's been fun. Uh, I'll see you guys next time. Take it easy.